Hello, best friend, and welcome, welcome back to my channel. I am me, a best friend. I am on one today, girl. I am moody. Okay, best friend, so listen, welcome back to my channel. If you are new, my name is Sebastian, and I welcome you all with open arms. I am so thankful and grateful. Today's the end of the month, best friend. Dios mío, the end of June. Tomorrow is the beginning of July. I'm so grateful to end the month with you guys and to start the month off with you guys with my knockoff Louis Vuitton hat, okay? Listen, best friend. I just got to say a couple things to you, okay? I'm on one today, so if you if you think that you've seen me moody, bitch, ooh, careful. Um, listen, uh, you know, Jennifer Lopez now is, uh, the media is changing, and now it's uh, coming off as she is, uh, not doing so well and that she's heartbroken and that she's devastated and sad and that she is you know basically the media is trying to portray her as some sort of victim and ben affleck like the stern and like the one who called everything off okay and i'm starting to see the the tides change and i'm like oh i know what they are doing they're gonna blame all this on ben affleck bitch oh jennifer gardner girl your house is about to be packed with drama Cause you know Ben Affleck, girl, he cuts his help with a fucking damn paper, paper clip or whatever the fuck, and he runs to Jennifer Garner's house and shows her. Okay, listen, that poor lady, girl, you should start doing the sequel to Thirteen Going on Thirty, so you're asking to be a little bit busy, bitch, because you are about to be a, his therapist, his shrink, his chef, his his freaking uh, towel of tears. Okay, because if the media is showing this already, girl, ooh. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry, best friend. But if you see a Sebastian Soto single coming out soon, fucking stream that shit, bitch. Because am I entering my vocal ability era? Because, ooh. Girl, I can hold a note. I can hold a note. I can hold a motherfucking note, bitch. Bitch. Okay. Listen. Um... Yeah, I it's you know it's a roller coaster that will never fucking end. It's a roller coaster that will never end, bitch. It is a roller coaster that will never motherfucking end. And it's like just going around and around. It's like fucking Groundhog's Day. It is Groundhog's Day. I don't know what is happening over there at the Affleck Lopez household, but best friend, they're gonna need to put it together. They're gonna need to put it together. They're gonna need it to put it together because ooh, this shit is nonstop, best friend girl. This is like, you know what this feels like? It feels like the situation fucking swallowed a 12 pack of fucking Viagra and just does not stop. I need you to stop popping a fucking melatonin, bitch. Popping a fucking melatonin, okay? Listen, why haven't they mentioned the divorce how come there hasn't been an announcement if there is a divorce or if there is going to be an announcement because of course it's all hearsay right i just don't get why they are prolonging it now i do know that jennifer lopez it, 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 i mean I, I you know i get it she is going to be probably the laughing stock of the internet for about a week or two but people are going to forget we're going to move on to other people and i do get it i mean that documentary that she did, The Greatest Love Story That Should Have Never Been Told, that that documentary, best friend, the This Is Me Now, $20 million, you know, later, um, that should never happen because I feel like that, that was her hocus pocus, bitch. She made brujeria on herself, okay, bitch, because I don't know what the hell. Listen, I will say this, okay? You know, and I don't get tired of saying this. I feel like the longer that they prolong it, the more that people are going to come up with their own situation. At least on my channel, we say allegedly, you know, I always t remind you guys to take things with a grain of salt. We see things that are on headlines. You know, we don't just talk about hearsay. There's a lot of people that have, listen, I get messages all day, every day, people saying, Sebastian, I have this tea. I have JLo this and JLo that and Ben Affleck. Listen, if there's not, if I thought, listen, as little as a headline from, you know, a source or a site 
then I'll talk about it. But there is a lot of things that are being said out there, which I don't know if it's true or not, but you know, there is a lot coming if, if it's true. I do think that there is a divorce. I think that they are prolonging it because I think that they're trying to get everything in order so Jennifer Lopez doesn't look like a clown. I think that Ben Affleck could care less what the media says because everyone is going to just put the 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 you know they're going to blame jennifer lopez for it and her obsession with fame and her obsession with making her relationship aesthetically pleasing right so now that if the media is trying to do any type of change and make her the heartbroken victim one and they're gonna you know come to to ben affleck and 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 say that he's a slob and that she's tired of it and this and that, then I see that how the media is about to change. And I see that right now, we're probably going to see a huge shift. And girl, I'm, I'm ready for the roller coaster ride, bitch. I'm ready for the roller coaster ride because I love a good roller coaster. As long as it doesn't go upside down. Why do all the damn roller coasters in Six Flags fucking get stuck upside down? I'm like, girl, this is not Disneyland budget, bitch. Okay, this is why I don't go to fucking Six Flags. I just wanted to say that. But listen, again, we'll see what happens. Allegedly, on a Friday, the, the divorce announcement is going to come out. You know what? I'm going to say this, and I'm going to say this, and I'm going to say this, okay? And I think I'm going to say it in a song. I'm going to say it in a song. I'm going to say it in a song because I'm into, into my vocal era, okay? Be relatable. Be honest and transparent. Selena Gomez is, and see how successful that she is because she is transparent, but Jennifer Lopez is not. Therefore, Sephora took JLo Beauty off, but Rare Beauty is the number one bestseller. So I guess the lesson that we have to learn here is that be honest and transparent and be relatable. Helps you win. Seriously, say, we're in marriage counseling. Say, we're, we're thinking about a divorce. We're separated right now. We have a lot of shit to get together. But why don't they fucking do it? Why? Because all they fucking care about is their stupid ass reputation. And that's all that they fucking matter. And I'm, I'm done. I'm, I'm. We can die. My dog is like, girl, what in the crazy is going on here? Look, he's like, I'm concerned. Bitch, I'm concerned too. I'm concerned too. Anyways, best friend, listen. Okay, so today's the end of the month, right? We're gonna change the subject because I have to give you some tips and tricks of what to do, okay? Today's a great day to clean your home, okay? Clean your home, not only, you know, uh, energetically, but also, bitch, do the damn laundry, fold the damn clothes, okay? Okay, I see you and that fucking... Um, What's that thing called? Your 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 um your laundry basket is full, bitch. It, you cannot put one more damn sock on that, okay, girl? Pick up your home, make it pretty, okay? Get good vibes going, put on a good song, okay? Um clean it energetically. You know, uh, I love to boil cinnamon and I love to put it all over my house, okay? Just put some cinnamon sticks, boil it. Cinnamon is abundant. If you have sage, do the saging. If you have Palo Santo, do the Palo Santo. The 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 way to do it is first. Um, um, girl, somebody just said, can you please speak low and uh, slower? Your voice is annoying. Oh my lord, I'm gonna sage you, bitch. So listen, you first sage, okay? You first sage your home with all the windows closed, okay? And saging is to get rid of, okay? So as soon as you're done, all the corners in the house, everywhere in your home. Then you open all the, the, the windows, the, the everything, and you let it all out, okay? That's letting go. Then I like to get Palo Santo, get my incense, get, you know, some good, um, you know, smells going. And that is how I bring abundance, okay? So clean your home. If you don't have sage or Palo Santo or anything, that's fine. Clean your home, organize your home, you know, open the windows, open it, you know, manifest good things, wish well upon people like I. I wish well on Jennifer Lopez. And I hope that you guys know my heart. I don't wish them to get a divorce. I don't wish them to for her to cancel her tour. I don't wish any ill will on nobody because quite frankly, I don't give a damn, okay? But I will say this, best friend. I wish everyone well. I may, I may, I may spill tea and throw some shade, but at the end of the day, girl, I have a good heart, okay, bitch. So listen, wish well, 
Be grateful for what you have. Let go of things, okay? Sometimes you gotta let go of things. Let go of people, let go of situations, let go of, of situationships or whatever the fuck they're called. If somebody is weighing you down and somebody should not be in your life, let go of them, best friend. Let go of them. Like that motherfucking bitch Elsa said. Let it go, let it go. Seriously, let it go. Um, and start brand new month tomorrow, best friend. A lot of people like to get cinnamon powder and blow it into their home on the first. If you feel comfortable, do that. I love to just, you know, have a, a clean, organized home, you know? And I know if you're depressed or lazy or stressed or whatever, and you don't get it done today, you can get it done tomorrow. You can get it done the second. The, the only thing that matters is the way that you're thinking, okay? And you say, you know what? I can't clean today. I'm busy. I'm at work. I'm tired. I'm, I'm you know, I'm, I'm exhausted or I'm not feeling well. That's fine, best friend. Do it tomorrow. Do it the day after. There is no stress. As long as in your mind, you know that you're going to have a beautiful month, that you wish everyone a beautiful month, you're going to have a beautiful month. So I love you all, best friend. I'm so grateful and thankful for you guys. You got tips, tricks, shape, everything in, in this fucking video. And I'm so grateful to be here. I'm so grateful for you guys. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Mwah.